There's only a few men that I would go gay for, and Satoru Gojo is one of them. Who's Satoru Gojo? He's the best. Oh, I know who he is now. <laughs> he is the best. Oh, you know, statistically, you have more chance in being a millionaire if you make. Did anyone else see got... that? Yeah, what? Isaac's got actual ghosts in his room. What the fuck? Shit. Oh, oh, ghost oh, ghost 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 oh, ghost orb! Ghost orb! Ghost orb! Ghost orb! Take a photo oh, again! Down. Found the bomb! Hello everybody, welcome back to the Winkies group channel. In today's video, we are going to be playing a little cheeky game called Never Have I Ever. No, no we're not. What, what the fuck am I on about? We're playing Who's Most Likely To. In this game, I'll be asking a bunch of randy ass questions and we will individually decide on who we think the person most likely to do whatever is in the question is. Does that make sense? I also got you guys involved in this video as well. Yes, you. My finger's a little bit too strong, sorry. We did also give you guys the option to vote in this as well. It's just nice to get a couple of extra answers on some of these questions. I do like to know what the audience think of us, you know? Especially if, uh, what is them's the main target. But if you do want to take part in any future group channel uploads, feel free to join our Discord server in the link down below. Hope you guys enjoy the video, it's a bit of a long one. See you later. Right, boys. Have you got your papers ready? I'm okay. dyslexic, don't bully my writing. Do you know what I like? I've got Dan. And if I turn it upside down, it's Wad. That is smart! Has Kyle been thinking Dan's name spelt with an M instead of an N this entire just, time? What is some? Just, just, just don't say anything, all right? Really? Just don't Kyle, say I'm so it's proud of you, man. I can't find a pen. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll just use this one. Who is the most likely to get into a bar fight? I have an answer for this. Well, I that is have, genuinely um, how these things work. I didn't have a bit of paper, so I'm using carrier bags. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one! I went Isaac. I voted for you because you're a big strapping man. And I feel like anybody who's big and strapping, whenever they have a drink, they get a little bit like, Ooh, look at me, I'm a big strapping man. And, and plus, you drink Stella. So, <laughs> yeah. you know. Fair that was, yeah. Fair so, that was, that was my sole reason he's a Stella drinker. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> I voted for Isaac purely on the Me basis also. that he likes to complain about things. And I feel like you're going to get a, a few shots down you, and there's going to be a group of teenagers behind you, right? And you're going to bloody moan and bitch about them, and they're going to hear you. And the next minute, you're having a bloody scrap with five lads. I mean, we're talking about a man who complained to the council because someone drove him <laughs> his own drive. It's time for me to reveal the answers. This is what the community thought. In last place, which is the uh, the pacifist of the group, I guess, is going to be Isaac. I think the community just doesn't know how annoying you are. They, they've, got, <laughs> they've got this, this false idea that you're nice. We can change that in Birmingham, my friend. In fourth place is Dr. Blue with 8.6%. In the Winky Awards, I come last in fucking everything. <laughs> <laughs> I'm somehow top of the fucking thing! Well, in this one, Kyle, you are third, my friend. Oh, with 18.6%. I think that's fucking false! Nope. <laughs> 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 oh that's my so god. Good. So, what is it? Would you like to record a Set 5 Must podcast episode where we start on someone <laughs> and fucking fire them at the same yes. time? The winner! of the most violent award goes to Wadism with 50% of the votes. <laughs> I've never had a fight in my life. <laughs> I got 30%. So you might have noticed that all the percentages are a little bit skewered. That's my fault. I may have forgot to end the form before recording this video. So, uh, yeah. Sorry about that. Who is the most likely to steal from the homeless? Give your answers in free. Oh, I'm not really yet. Hang on. What is them? <laughs> Dan, yeah! I've self-reported, to be fair. What is them is just a filthy fucking criminal. Look at him. <laughs> Breaks the law on a bloody regular basis. Look at the state of him! I Isaac. voted Dr. Blue because I can remember him having a fat rant about, like, public transport and people, like, annoying him on the bus. And I can imagine him on the way back from commute and he's all riled up because there's some stinky people on the back of the bus. He gets off and someone says, like, change, sir, and he goes, boom, and then takes their, like, drink or something and walks home just because he's <gasps> riled up. That's, that's my theory. I voted Kyle because, um, 
I didn't want to vote what again because that seemed mean. So I guess for secretly it was one percent. So in last place, it's Doctor Blue with seven point one percent. In fourth, it's me with twelve point nine percent. In third place, it's Isaac with eighteen point six. Mr. Bio in second place with 28.6%, you filthy criminal, Kyle. <laughs> in first place is Watterson with 429 There's a common theme with these answers. Um, anything slightly illegal, uh, Watterson's one of the main culprits for. I would never commit a crime. Who is most likely to collect rocks? <laughs> well, there are two answers here. Well, let me just interrupt you there, Isaac, because the community also thought there was two answers. Three. <clears throat> Two, one. I'll do it for the meme. What I was. I... <laughs> he's self-reported. The reason I went Wadism is because he's autistic, and I feel like he'd get fixated on rocks and be like, <laughs> "Oh, I'm <laughs> Bro, bro I I suddenly you start collecting. You're, you're going around I like these are from the ground. <laughs> I think we all know why we're voting for Kyle. The guy's a bloody weirdo. He collects yeah, like but... skulls and shit. But let's figure oh, out what I the community sh said, shall yeah. we? So in last place, it's me. Alright, I don't yeah, think I have sense. any rocks on the go. In fourth place is gonna be Big Watersome with 15.7%. Do you remember yeah, when Isaac said that. there was two answers? That's interesting scared. because third place is Dr. Blue with 21.4% <laughs> of the answers. And with a solid three vote difference, the winner of this is Mr. Bio. Oh! We finally got you an award, Kyle. Yeah, he's, he's won. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, they're found in the soil and they're found in caves. And I love them all. I want to down because I love rock. I don't know where I'm going with this. I was trying to do a poem, but can we just skip this question? <laughs> Fuck this. Who, out of all of us, is the most likely to piss on the seat? We're talking urine. That's oh, so usually what pisses my mum. Yeah, well, I didn't know if you meant like cum or sweat or something. What is it? Does sweat come out of your dick? <laughs> it depends how hard it goes. <laughs> <laughs> depends how good your mum's top is. Oh, uh, yeah, Ooh. I went there. Got him. Free. Two! One and a half! Oh. <laughs> one! Me? I got one vote and I'm offended. <laughs> 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 I just see one of them just being drunk and just fucking unleashing hell. And then looking down at it, not realising that he's pissed everywhere, he sees it for the first time and he just goes, <laughs> Even just during sessions, he needs to go to the toilet 24-7. I self-voted myself because of several reasons. Uh, I always <laughs> look at on my phone when I'm pissing and I often just, I don't pay attention where the barrel's aiming. When I'm drunk, I'm glad I'm at a urinal because, bro, it goes fucking everywhere. Thirdly, big dick, in it? You face everything with a, a cocky confidence and I can have an <laughs> image in my head, right, of you going to the <laughs> toilet and going, I don't need my hands. So you stand like this and just try. Do you know what the worst thing is? I've actually tried that before and it did go everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what the community think of this, this immaculate question. All right, so in last place is Dr. Blue with 5.7%. In fourth place is Mr. Bio with 12.9%. <laughs> Third place is me, 21.4%. It's what? It's gotta be what? It's gonna be me. What is it, Dan? Tell us. <laughs> it's Isaac no, in Isaac. second place. I knew it. I can... oh. And with 25 <laughs> votes, two more votes than Isaac Rose, it's bloody Waterson. Checks out. I did piss the bed like a year ago. Who is the most likely to get the most female attention in brackets online and IRL? You know what? I'm going to go odd poorly. I am ready. I am also ready. I am ready. I am ready. I'm ready. Three, two, one. That's a mixed I, bag. I, that's a that's a I, Tesco I, bag I, as well. I, I can't <laughs> even read what Wadism says. I said Wadism because he, he gives daddy vibes, and I oh. think people like the daddy vibes. I went with blue. Pure under, well, I've got two reasons. So, first of all, you go into his live stream shot and it's like 90% women. He's you don't got think that... I'm gay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't, I don't, I don't. Second of all, you've got that sort of ghost kink going on. Like, you're a masked man. No one knows what's behind the mask, but everyone likes the mask, if you know what I mean. Still. He's calling you a bag job. So I'd put dangle, because I've literally been there when a girl asks him out. We're at Comic-Con and the girl's just like, I'll take you on a date. He's like, no. <laughs> 
<laughs> it just gets asked out in front of me all the time, and I'm like, oh, that was nice, wasn't it? I chose Daniel because I look like a dick if I choose myself. But... <laughs> <laughs> Good answer. I like that. And and Andy's a muscular man, so oh, thanks, women Kyle. love that. And, Thank you. Andy, he, you know what? Nah, I won't lie. It's the dinosaurs. It's the dinosaur shirt. Yeah. Pulls the puss. True. Bitches love dinosaurs. In last place, which I disagree with, is Dr. Blue with 12.9%. <laughs> That's a fucking insult, that. <laughs> you've oh, not got a face on my Yeah, you don't show it yourself. You do not have a face. Yeah. What do you mean? With 14.3%, it's going to be Mr. B.O. What is in third place? Dan is definitely first. Ed, 100%. Yeah. All right, Carl. All right. Can <laughs> <laughs> you spin the shit he's so people say about that? I <laughs> he was my he, vote, right, right, but... but... Yes. <laughs> I voted for him to win, so yes, I'm saying it's Dan. Thanks, Kyle. Thanks for boosting the ego. Isaac. It is you. In first place is Isaac. Ooh. I'm joking. Yeah, it was me. It was me yeah. with 47 <laughs> points. Who is the most likely to have, <laughs> to have a secret foot fish? Oh, I yeah. swear to fucking God. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God. Sounds like Blue knows the answer as well. Three, two, one, go. You. <laughs> Bear <laughs> <laughs> in mind, so, Isaac, people's impressions of us will be different from what we know. The people don't know about your secret foot fish. It's going on in the group chat like, boys, I saw Anna's heel today. It was well good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why did you we vote for down. Blue? <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to kink shame. I just feel oh, like no. he's doing some weird things here and there. I think Blue's into the, the, more, reason... the more outlandish sexual things. Just because you want to be stepped on doesn't mean you like what they're stepping on you with. In last place, we've... 18.6% of the votes is me, which I find oh, hilarious because I literally work rigged. with feet. So yeah, that's that's, yeah. that's funny. Oh, I never threw that. Yeah. I don't you know like the Kids vote. Feet as well, you filthy. You know what? Change, I would like to change my answer. <laughs> <laughs> that's like fucking Dexter working for the police, man. That's fucking. That's like <laughs> yeah. fucking little, good little cover that. In but fourth but place, in Kyle, be quiet. In fourth <laughs> place, with 27.1% of the votes, is Isaac at Rose. Yeah. I come last in every category. We go to the fucked up shit. Oh yeah, let's vote him mid to top <laughs> here, bro. Like, Ross, let's give him an award. So, this is a peculiar answer. In second place, there's a joint second. Is Mr. Bio and what is him? And in first place is Dr. Blue! That's probably just overpowered by my community, because they're all little freaks, and they like to talk about feet, and they like to put their fucking shit on me. I don't like feet, man! I will claw you, sweet of god, mate! Oh, I was so hoping that would be more dramatic. <laughs> yeah, I was hoping that would be more dramatic. Who's most likely to fuck it on a night out? Which means you pass out, you vomit everywhere. What is this just the Ralph Wiggum meme right now? Hey, Mindy! <laughs> Lou, you have two Copperbergs and get tipsy. What the fuck are you on about? Three, two, what? one, oh, bang! Right. Oh, come on, Dan. What the fuck? I can random. hold my drink better than any of you. I had Wadism as my answer initially, but then I did. I thought about what you said. Like anytime Blue seems to have a few drinks, he just <laughs> seems to just vomit everywhere. Like, <laughs> the community have spoken. They Go have on. said last place is Doctor Blue with eighteen point six percent. Strongest drinker, Doctor Blue. You got the strongest drinker award. <laughs> Alcoholic. <laughs> and then next is Mr. Bio with 20%, me with 21.4%, Isaac with 30%, this is <laughs> and Watterson <laughs> with 38.6%. They've probably, they've probably just got that because you're the only one who openly downs bottles of wine on the street. I drink wine like it's juice. <laughs> the truth hurts, it's a cruel world. Life is Dude, you got disabled after drinking two beers and had hiccups for about half an hour. <laughs> Who is the most likely to complain to the council about troublesome teenagers? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this, I feel like this is maybe a little bit too you know No, my luck. I'll probably fucking win this one as well. I've got to go with the obvious answer. Yeah, I mean, we all know it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Esco, yeah. We all know. Yeah, we all know. I was the only one who didn't vote myself. I, I voted blue because I feel like if there were some kids outside, like his flat or house, and they were causing a ruckus, I feel like he would do something about it. <laughs> There's a Karen among us, you see. And it's not me. It's not Mr. Bio. It's not Dr. Blue. The Karen of the group. <laughs> Are you talking about if it's what is the mice? Is, is this what the community have voted? The Karen of the group with 55.7% of the votes 
is what is him? He's oh, I one push like kid. away from dolphin diving out that window, bro. He's <laughs> Who is so most so likely to have a secret drug empire, Breaking Bad style? Three, two, one, bong. Ooh, Ooh very, very. Mm. Are you self-reporting? Yeah, boy. Don't tell us anything. In your Skyler. No way. I need the police over here right now. So, why oh, did you vote yep. yourself? Uh, I don't know, to be honest. I think, uh... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> maybe, maybe my story about being paid to sleep is a little too believable. I voted Dan because he's the only one who works in a retail, and I feel like he could, like, put the drugs in the shoes I was he sells thinking them, and, like, that. it'd be a really good, like, trafficking <laughs> spot. That is smart, to be fair. I could have done that in my old job, where I just left people at Sports Direct with the shoes, because I didn't give a shit. Yeah. I have to serve people now, Isaac. I can't just, uh, I can't just do back. that. I went Kyle, because I can just imagine him in the outback. That's pretty much the reason I voted yeah. Kyle as well. Plus, he just also, looks like, he looks like he has something to hide as well. I voted Blue. Because I feel like with all his computer like knowledge and how smart he is, he could do the books and keep it. Ooh. He could do a lot of money laundering. Be very smart with it. Blue's very switched on. He woke up about half an hour ago. What do you mean switched on? Well, would I you mean, like to know what the community thought? No, I'm, I'm, in no, last place it. is MXZ with 8.6. Fourth it's place is Wadism with 22.9%. Third boy. place is good gonna good be place. me. 28.6. So in second place, it's going to be Dr. Blue with 35.7%. And in first place is Mr. B.O. with 40% of the votes. Well done, Kyle. And the one who knocks. Cheers, Kyle. Well, if you're knocking at my fucking door, I'm not answering, mate. Next question. <laughs> who, <laughs> who is the most likely to perform suspicious acts with their cousin? Hypothetically, we all have one and we're all Christ. single. Well, if anyone says me because my cousins are like six, then... <laughs> <laughs> I'll be changing my answer now. Three, two, one. I just, <laughs> I just voted Bro. Kyle on the basis that if his cousins are as fine as his mum and his nan are, then Ooh. I mean it's a no-brainer. Yeah. Kyle has occasionally made some comments where we've gone, "Oh, your mum's fit," and he's like, "Yeah." <laughs> no. I know who she's fit, bro. Like, I know she's hot. I'm not blind. I just don't find her attractive, but I know subjectively she is. But doesn't mean I want to shag my cousin. I mean, it might. The worst but, you know. part is, my cousins actually watch my videos. Hi, Kyle. I didn't want to say that. Hi, Kyle's cousins. Hi. Yeah. I swear to well, God, if the community thinks I fuck my cousins like my <laughs> friends do, I'm fucking done, bro. Okay, the community have spoken. I can hear their voices. In last place, and... To be honest with you, the winner of this is me, with 10% uh, of the votes. Oh. Fourth is going to be Isaac Rules, with 15.7. Third place is Dr. Blue. What is him? What is him? Why are you? Why are What is him? You've swear, got a six-year-old cousin. <laughs> one of them's four, one of them's I, and one of them's ten. Why are you fucking him, what is him? That's pretty weird as fuck. <laughs> Fortunately. Wadism is not a paedophile today because oh, he's in second place. That, Kyle, huh? congratulations on, the, on your <laughs> reward, my man. With 41.4% of the votes. Who is the most... What the hell? <laughs> 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 Who is the most likely to get pegged? Well, oh, come it's on. Me. It's just... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even any suspense. It's, it's just no suspense. We don't yeah. need to... Yeah. We don't need to reveal. Yeah. It's just... It is me. So, Blue, why'd you get pegged? <laughs> Top. The what results the are in. Da, 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 da. The community have spoken. And with a whopping 95% of the votes, it's Dr. Blue. I'm joking, I'm joking. It's not really, it's not really. Oh. In joint last place, it's me and Kyle. This is quite a funny one. In third place, it's Wadism. <laughs> I'm fine for that. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine for that. It's Isaac. No way, it's Isaac. Unfortunately, it's not Isaac today, I'm afraid, I gentlemen. <laughs> Dr. Blue won with 42.9%. Yeah. This one I only ask because it gets asked in like every single fucking live stream I see. When but, he's custom? No, no, no. That would be a really good one, actually. That would be a good <laughs> question. He's most likely to do custom. So, who? is the most likely to win in a Royal Rumble between five of us. I'm oh, sick of being nasty, okay. so let's yeah, fucking cast yeah, the votes. Let's put a nail in that coffin. Right, I've got my answer, and I've got a good reason right. for it as well. Three, three, three two, two, one. Let's roll. I've gone Wad, 
because I know that there's going to be some bullshit going on in that fight. The He's biggest smart. threat in that would be, to me, Kyle. So I'd want to get Kyle out as fast as possible, but I feel like you'd all have some fucking, especially Blue, Isaac and Ward, you'd have some little, uh, you'd have some team going on, <laughs> and you'd aim for me or Kyle first to try and get us out all together, right? I think that you get me out first, then you get Kyle out first, all of you, and then you get Blue out, because Isaac and Ward would communicate behind the scenes, be like, okay, let's get Blue out third, and then... It's between them two, and I think Ward would take it. Dan had a full, like, Yagami moment where he's, like, yeah. planted all out in his he hands. Full <laughs> <of> his <laughs> <before>. <laughs> I have, like, yeah. I have. Um, yeah, no, I think Dan would destroy me and crush my head for sport. <laughs> with my fives. Yeah, well, maybe that's the next set five maths. I said Kyle because, it. like, if it is Royal Rumble and it is WE, he'll, like, fucking take one of the ropes off of the side and use some, like, Australian knots and strangle people with it, you know? He's wily. <laughs> He's Next crafty. Up. In last place, they obviously don't know about the mong strength. It's Dr. Blue with 8.6. In fourth place is Isaac Rose with 12.9. Mr. Bile is third. Yeah. 14.3. Set five maths are the strongest. You know? <laughs> you got 20% second place one is a five of one with 54.3, which is the community high. completely forgot about my sweat and I can do like a slip and slide kind of deal. Yeah. No, one, no one can grab yeah. you. Oh, yeah. shit, yeah. Exactly. I didn't even think of that when I was voting. I would have changed my answer to you for that. Not to mention, it's the longer he goes, the wetter the arena becomes. So then we're all slipping over. <laughs> we're like, we're fucked. And I can bounce I mean, off the ropes. I'm like, come you like a ball. It's almost like martyrdom if we get him out first as well. Because he just leaves. He, he's out of the game, but he leaves the fucking yeah. arena just a mess. <laughs> Who is most likely to have a happy ending massage at Thai Parlor? Let's go. Oh, Me? okay. I'm Eggshell I HD. I don't no. want to. <laughs> no. I'm the host, I want it. Blue and I had to wait for the um the gun range. We're just making these jokes because no matter where we went, there was ten massage parlors around this like gas station. There was like oh. three of them. We what, just sat what, there for so at, long. At one point, I was like, it's taking a while. Should we just go in, find out? You know, <laughs> <laughs> you go to these tannin places. You know, it wouldn't be out of the question to also get a massage. I go for my ex Isaac. <laughs> <laughs> and you're, it, it kind and you're of lost. like fits into the whole regime. Yeah, I'm and kind of buying I that. see that actually. Also, if the boys were going in, I'd go in as well. You know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be a problem. What together? To you'd, yeah. you'd go All in. Yeah, yeah, we can look at each other in the eyes. The community have spoken once again. They won't bloody shut up. So in last place, surprise and answer is me. Uh, with 12.9. <laughs> Fourth place is uh, Mr. Bile, 17.1. <laughs> Second and first look really Blue close. Blue has got to win this. I'm I sure. swear to God, it's Waterson wins. It's Waterson, isn't it? It, it can't that be me and be... Isaac top two. We're the only two with girlfriends. Yeah. That would be funny, though. <laughs> that would be, actually, <laughs> yeah. Makes no sense. <laughs> In third place, it's Waterson. With 27.1. There's no way. There's no way. It's not Isaac, is it? Congratulations, Isaac, on your first award. Thirty-two point nine percent of the votes. Really? Yeah. That's the one. You really? fucking horny bastard, Isaac. What are you Isaac, doing? You freak. That's <laughs> gross, bro. That is How dare you? Graceful. It's all coming out now. That's what the masseuse said, dude. If yeah, we thought the fanfics yeah. were bad before, they're gonna be nuts after this video goes out.